Win number 10, man, that's, that means a lot to a lot of teams. Well, it means a lot, you know, it was great to end the seniors with a, with a W. And, you know, I'm excited for this whole team. An opportunity out there to play in a pretty big bowl game. Rose Bowl means a lot, a lot of folks here now. They won the start of the season, but Rose Bowl is still pretty good. Oh, yeah, Rose Bowl is a huge game, you know. People, uh, people are undermining that game, but, you know, we're, we're excited for that game. And we're ready to play. Is that TD pass a tad behind you? Is that a good grab on your part? Excuse me, I'm sorry. Or TD pass. Is that uh, a tad behind you? Um, I think it was there. I think it was it was, it was good. It was it was in a good place for me to grab it, and uh, I grabbed it. Hey, where's, where's your confidence level right now? Like like two two games in a row like this for you? Like just like how how good does this feel for you? Um, my confidence level is very high. It's the highest it's ever been. It's been that way the whole year, and it's going to continue to elevate. John, it's not on one guy, but there was a season low in passing. Under 200 yards against the pass defense that ranks 120th. Just what was it that they were doing that was kind of preventing you guys from getting the rhythm? Um, I think we just had to execute better. I think we were shooting ourselves in the foot a lot, um, which is little mistakes, little mental mistakes. Is there any point of feeling a little bit of concern for the offense? At one point, they've got the ball in a touchdown game with like four minutes to go. Oh, uh, we just know we had to get rolling. We had to, you know, we couldn't let them get back in the game, but you know, we were just motivated to go out there and get another touchdown. Chance Cesario will face Utah. Pretty fierce and deep, real big. A lot of NFL type guys. Oh uh, yeah, what do you think about that challenge. Oh, uh, they're a great team, and we're excited to play them if, if they make it. And, you know, we'll be ready for what they, what they have. Physically, though, you guys ready for a physical game on offense? For you guys? Oh yeah, we're a very physical team overall, uh, especially on offense. You know, even in the perimeter, we're a physical wide receiver group, and we're ready for that. What's it like to watch Michael Wright have that type of game again? Um, you know, I love I love Mikhail. You know, he always makes big plays. I had a feeling he was actually gonna crib one today, and um, you know, it's, it's happy. It's happy to see a, a young dude like that that puts the work in. It's happy to see him showing it on Saturday. What kind of feeling? Um, excitement. You know, it's excitement. You know, I'm proud. It's a proud feeling. How, how do you feel like you guys are playing right now versus like how you can play? Play like just where where on the scale? Are you? Um. No, I think we're I think we're not playing to our best right now. I think we could play a lot better. Um, but it, it's, there's flashes of it there. You know, we, we had a lot of red zone trips. You know, we just got to finish those drives. How yeah. excited are you to have the opportunity to maybe show that you can play better than what you're playing right now? Um, wait, can you repeat that? I'm sorry. Yeah. <laughs> How excited are you to have an opportunity to play again to show mm. that you can play better than you are right now? Oh, very excited. You know, it's like, it's, like, it's always a good feeling to have that other that next game um, and that bowl game. In that championship game, you know, I'm excited to see what we can do. Yeah, when, when fans are going to be looking for answers, and it's not to make excuses again, not to point fingers, but you guys have lost guys at tight end. Breland's not here. Mm -hmm. Kidman's gone down. You guys have lost a lot of skill position players. Is this affecting the rhythm of the offense? Is that just reality? Not an excuse, just that's what's happening. I think we've had dudes step up and dudes are making plays. Um, you know, it's hard losing dudes here and there, but you know, we got to keep rolling as an offense at the end of the day. After last week's loss, was it harder or maybe easier to, to refocus and get ready for this one? Um, you know, we were on to the next game. You know, after that loss, it was obviously heartbreaking for us as a team. But, you know, we were on to the next one on Monday, and we were ready to play this game. Did, did anyone say anything in between that third and fourth quarter after the after third quarter no points scored? Did anybody say anything in the huddle uh, before you guys went out to kind of spark something? Um, we were all just reiterating that we needed to get going and we needed to finish these drives. You know, Justin was saying, you know, we need to get going. And, you know, every, everybody was just, everybody was straining everybody on. Did anything feel like it wasn't really clicking that well for you guys? Or was it just, uh, we, just had, to we just had to finish those drives at the end of the day. We weren't finishing. Thanks, Johnny. Thank, Thank you, Johnny. Johnny. Appreciate it. Yep.